In this year's Diamond League meeting in Paris, France, Fred Curley raced against Kenny Benarek in the men's 200 meter dash. In this year's Olympics, both of these athletes won silver medals in their respective events, with Curley winning the silver in the 100 meters and Benarek winning the silver in the 200. These two sprinters have both been running incredible times this season, and in this one 200 meter race, they would challenge each other all the way to the finish line. After a fair start, both Curley and Benarek were already clear of the field after the first 100. But over this final 100 meters, these two traded the lead back and forth multiple times. First it was Benarek, then it was Curley, then Benarek again, but finally over the closing stages of this race, Curley's sprinting strength ultimately prevailed, as he just barely placed first by the absolute smallest of margins. Upon finishing this race, both athletes were listed with a finishing time of 19.79 seconds, which is certainly a very impressive performance. However, in order to pick a winner in this event, we have to go beyond just tenths or even one hundredths of a second, because with an exact finishing time of 19.784, Curly took down Benaric by just five one thousandths of a second which is way faster than just a blink of an eye, making this one of the closest finishes in 200 meter history. This is just one of many great races this season for both athletes. They were both Olympic medalists, they both have been improving with incredible new personal bests. However, Fred Curley has done something this season that only two other athletes have ever achieved, and that's managed to run under 10 seconds for the 100, under 20 seconds for the 200, and under 44 seconds for the 400 meters. The only other athletes to ever achieve this feat have been Wade van Niekerk from South Africa and Michael Norman from the United States. This task requires amazing speed and top tier strength, but beyond just this amazing triple sprinting achievement, Fred Curley has done something this year that nobody else in history has ever done, and that's win a global championship medal in both the 100 and in the 400 meters. Before 2021, Curley had consistently been one of the world's fastest 400 meter athletes, and occasionally, he might run a 200 meter race. However, after winning the Olympic silver in the 100 and achieving a new personal best of 9.84, his decision to switch to the 100 meters was definitely the correct one. Thanks for watching, everyone. And as always, until next time.